Alright, well, hello everyone, I'm back with another video, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing commentary for the new Commander Survival Challenge Tournament, alright? So that's going to be hosted by Fat Squatch, alright? And I'm going to be doing commentaries here versus, uh, I mean, uh, Mahavir versus Grey Hat. Alright, now without, uh, without further ado, let's jump str uh, straight to it. Oh, but before I forgot, uh, you know, before I forget... Please do subscribe on my channel and turn on the notification to not miss an upload or stream from my channel. Might as well check out Fat Squatch videos, Fat Squatch games. The link is in the description below this video and I highly recommend that you guys check it out. Alright, and so without further ado, let's jump straight to it. Alright, let's go ahead and play. Okay, oh, alright, so uh, am I able to zoom it in? No, I cannot, okay. Oh, I actually, uh... Repeated the battle. Okay, well, let's go. Okay, so Mahavir will be the red player, and Grey Hat, of course, will be the blue player since he is Confederation. Okay, let's see how this goes. Uh, Grey Hat does have a very good upgrade, but does play uh, very, very rarely. Alright, so the two barracks are uh, going out, or right, actually finished building. Okay, um, there's actually no boost here, so. Yep, boost is I think not allowed in this clan. Um, no, uh, commander survival challenge. So yeah, boosts are not allowed. So this is purely no boost. Okay, and uh, it's gonna be upgrading HQ four. Okay, before that third supply center. Let's see how this goes. Collecting containers and the third barracks has been built. Okay. Okay. So Mahavir is actually doing. Uh, quite nicely here okay collecting some containers it's quite neat okay very nice okay there's like another container at the very uh, back of the base okay and now a uh, factory has now been built okay okay so there it goes now the remaining riflemen are either going to be sent to scout the base of Grey Hat okay so third supply center is still underway. HQ still underway. HQ level two still underway. Okay, no major issues whatsoever, whatnot here. Okay. Oh man, barely got that container. Okay, that's quite nice that Mahavir, uh, I mean Grey Hat was able to get it. But let's see how will this go. Will Mahavir go for a Jaguar, Grenadiers, or just the typical Armadillo sniper army composition? We'll find out. Okay, it's my. It's also my first time uh, watching this. Now, Grey Hat, on the other hand, um, did not really collect that much container. There's actually a container at the top, middle right side, the hand corner of the map, and bottom right hand corner. Okay, that's actually quite weird that uh, a container has been missed right there. Now a a shipyard is now being built. Okay, a sniper tower being built also to deny further scouting. Okay, and uh, uh, supply center again, the fourth supply center, the fifth supply center, very nice. Okay, so uh, Mahavir got a great, or actually a good look at the base of uh, Grey Hat right there. Okay. Alright, let's see how this goes. Oh. Okay, second sniper tower being built. Shipyard almost done in less than 10 seconds. There it goes. Now I think that's going to be like a coyote being built or going to be produced. Okay, I really wish that uh, Mahavir would like scout another, uh, yeah, send another scout or at least those two riflemen earlier before those uh, riflemen got there. There's also a container from above the cliff or actually from above the base. Uh, there it goes. There's that one container right there. One Imba container. Okay. And now a Kaiman should be out of the shipyard by now. Okay. Assault right here. And the sniper tower is there to deny scouting. Now I'm just curious how will this go? Will uh, Grey Hat go for Zeus Vertex uh, cameras? Or will just rush? Uh, I'm not exactly sure. But let's uh, see what will happen here. 
Now, Grey Hat, guys, does have a very, very good upgrade for rank 11. Okay, very, very good upgrade. But I don't think that he can catch it due to lack of experience. Alright, and there goes HQ, rank to level 3. Okay, let's see if he can pull this off. Okay, Mahavir. Now going after more, or produce more Kaimans, which totally makes sense. Okay, oh man, you need to build that naval platform and then destroy two barracks. Uh, putting up another sniper tower right there. Okay, just like one missed container at the bottom, or at the top. Okay, so there's not actually any room here to build, except uh, for building another... Uh, construction yard all right two kaimans are here to guard the uh, shipyard while the uh, naval platform is being built a fortress has been used to scout okay what a very good scout right there so technically gray hat knows what uh, mahavir is up to okay another delta has been sent to the top okay top shore so let's see there's like two kaimans there to deny the scouting okay All right, there's like that one shipyard. Oh wow, placing minefields right there. Okay. Oh, more deltas are coming over. Okay, deltas are still being produced. Okay, very nice, very nice. Hmm. Is there like an option to another? Oh, no option. Okay, so like two deltas can actually kill three kaimans. Okay, so. Grenadiers are now going to be added into the mix. Fourth, I think. No, a third sniper tower. A fourth sniper tower is on the way. Okay, a scout has been sent by uh, Mahavir to Grey Hat's base. Let's see what he is up to. Okay. Now, mind you guys, this is recorded live by the players who are participating in the program or in the tournament. Okay. Mm-hmm. Still uh, no action here. Both bases or both players are still macroing up. Okay, there's like three armadillos here present at the moment from Mahavir. Okay. Mm-hmm. One naval platform is complete. Alright. Level 3 HQ from Mahavir. Okay, nothing crazy so far from from Grey Hat. Just two vehicle factory with, you know, I, I I think that there will be a rush here that's coming on because there's like two vehicle factories, so that can either be hammers or fortress with heavy assaults or assaults with hammers. Okay, so yeah, two vehicle factories are has been confirmed. Okay, one assault has been uh, seen right there. Okay, so technically this. Uh, Yep, this, uh, or Grey Hat actually saw this, uh, Armadillo is moving in here. Alright, there's like, whoa, like five hammers? Okay, those are li literally five hammers, and you can't hope to achieve by, uh, you know, you can't hope to win that battle, man. Okay, so, um, I think, uh, Mahavir has had it, he'll go for Jaguars. Okay, Alligators are now gonna be in production as well. Okay, the level three vehicle factory also on the way. Nothing crazy so far between the two. Just them doing macro on their base. Okay. Alligators are now being produced. Okay. Second alligator. Mm-hmm. Okay, here goes. So those Kaimis are to see what, uh, how many defenses are there. Okay. Second uh, barracks aren't going to be on the way. So there will be Jaguars since there will be level 3 vehicle factory. Okay, so at the 8 minute mark, that's quite fast. Okay, Viking and are going to be produced. Saw that uh, shipyard now level 2. Okay, so those, uh, or actually every unit are now going to force fire or focus fire their uh, weapons on that lone shipyard right there without any defenses. Okay, as expected. Uh, Grey Hat is uh, making a mistake. Okay, there it goes. Ah, oh, nice pickup right there from that, from those alligators getting rid of those shipyard, or that shipyard right there. 
Okay, now Naval Platform is now going to be built. Mm -hmm. Now again guys, this uh, survival uh, challenge doesn't have any boost. So you're not allowed to use any boost at all. Alright, no boost. No super weapons. Just your units. Duke it out until you end the battle. Okay, here guys. So another, uh, wait, what just happened there? Yeah, what just happened? I don't understand what just happened here. Why those two alligators got wrecked by uh, a Viking and uh, a pos no, no, a naval platform being built? I am not sure. I did not see. Okay, there it goes. One naval platform being built. Alligator just popped out. Okay, he will now try and go see what the enemy has or what Grey Hat has. Okay. Mm hmm. No. Oh wow. Okay, so there's like a naval platform. Oh wow. So technically, a shipyard has been replaced with naval platforms. Okay, that's cool. Okay, so that one alligator ain't gonna change anything. Okay, there's like a unit. Ooh, that's like a lot. A lot of hammers. Okay. So hammers are coming over to the left side, right, left right hand side of the map. And uh, hold up, hold up. There's like a Jaguar in a very bad position right there. Delta coming from the top or the north. Okay, there's like not really that uh, many hammers right there. Oh man. Okay, so Gradiers are now going to be produced along with some uh, Jaguars. Jaguars has now sieged the, you know, below the cliff. Okay, and now sieging above the cliff course and oh man gray hat we're going to just will destroy that special vehicle factory while it's being upgraded okay that's uh, quite a bit of a blunder right there however at the exchange of a lot of hammers all right so that's not really worth it i'd say yeah that's not really worth the damage but it's still a damage overall okay if he can pick that uh, power plant that would be very very nice Okay, he was able to pick up that power plant. Now the Grenadiers are coming over to deal with that hammer. Okay, nice. Alright, now let's see how this goes. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so yeah. Still, no scout whatsoever. Okay. Just the scout at the very start. And now mines are going to be placed from Mahavir. Okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Power plant now going to be used. Nope. Porcupine rather. Okay. So there's like an excess power here of 119 power rather. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Here goes. A scout of a Kaiman there revealing that there's no more shipyards. So there's no pending threat from the Navy. Or anything from the ocean. Okay, just those Delta earlier. Okay, so another Jaguar is gonna be uh, placed right there. Okay, or uh, produced. Wow, some of the units are actually marching forward to Grey Hat's base. Okay, it's not positioning them, but there's actually a cliff that the bunker is around, so the bunker can see below the cliff and uh, see what the yeah, formation Mahavir has from above the cliff. Okay, so uh, Jaguars are now going to be here sieging up. Let's see how this goes. Okay, assaults are now running into, you know, running into those hammers or Jaguars. Okay. Oh, so technically that bunker's uh, life will now end. Okay, due to the three Jaguars that are firing at it. Now Zeus are now uh, Zeus are going to be produced as well from uh, from Grey Hat. Okay, what a perfect counter for this uh, kind of attack. Okay, a Zeus. However, will the Zeus count be enough? Will that be enough? I don't think so. Okay, so Grenadiers are here, of course, to help out with the attack and be annoying as humanly possible. Okay. Oh. The, the Jaguars are all already above the cliff. First Zeus just popped out. No, I don't think that's a Zeus. That's like a hammer. 
Okay, level 3 vehicle factory zoos are at the, uh, yep, at the bottom side of the construction yard right there from Grey Hat. Okay, Grey Hat now producing mammoths, porcupines. Oh man, this is actually a, a one sided battle, perhaps. Yeah, a one sided battle indeed. Okay. Now let's see how this goes. Oh man. Alright, well, pretty much, uh, Mahavir already got this in the bag. <coughs> because, uh, Grey Hat failed to attack on the ground, spending much resources on those hammers, which did not provide any good results, aside from destroying a special vehicle factory and a power plant and some units only, but was repelled right away. Alright, so, yeah, I mean, that's kind of, it's kind of bad, okay, but still, okay, so I think uh, Grey Hat is uh, going to give up just like that. I don't think so because uh, he rarely plays the game so yeah oh there's still a construction yard being built <coughs> ah excuse me okay so grenadiers are going to take care of that HQ so there will be no more HQ for gray hat right there okay now gray hat actually did very badly here from scouting to everything Though he did good with the Delta Scout, that I agree. Okay. Now the thing that he can do better that there was like to scout, you know, every now and then into the uh, bottom right hand corner of the map to see where the army of of Mahavir will head into, so he can intercept on time. Oh wow! And Mahavir went for the composition of Grey Deer's Jaguar and Chameleon. What a nice. Uh, what a nice uh, unit combination right there. I, I love it. Okay. Now keep in mind, Javier did not use any boost as this uh, challenge should have a no boost challenge. So there's no boost allowed. Alright, so that's going to be it for this video. And again, guys, thanks for watching. Have a great day and good luck with your battles. Oh, and by the way, don't forget to check out my previous videos as it contains tips and tricks that may help you win a battle. Again, thanks for watching, have a great day, and good luck with your battles. Bye now!